So Jay, you are a best-selling author. Mm. You have two books, Anchor Boy yeah. and Number Two. That's right. Okay, well, we don't have time to talk about what those books are about. How would you describe each book with a quick facial expression? I love this question. Okay, okay so first, Anchor Boy. Anchor Boy, very simple, it's like, Ooh, okay. Yes. And then number two is like, oh, okay. like number two. Because like, it's that sequel that's more challenging. Got right? you. you have a podcast as well. Yes. Um, if you had to describe it with like a sound effect, what would you go with? Uh, it'd just be because it's just a lot of poop talk, mm -hmm. which is appropriate for where we're doing this interview. You shoot it in, in the bathroom? Actually, we shoot it in the TSN radio studio, which oh. is considered by some to be the bathroom oh, of, of CTV. Yeah. Um, so fans often say your show is the first thing they watch when they wake up, last thing they watch when they go to bed. Mm -hmm. I guess our question is like, what do you do when your fans are sleeping? Yeah. Ah, great question. I mean, I, I work at night, you know, because I'm working nights. Because, um, and I, it's funny how few people realize this. I think they think that we get up in the morning and do the show live when they see it live. Right. Um, we do it live at midnight and then it loops all morning. I am a vinyl guy. I like to listen to tunes. Do you wear a lot of vinyl as well? Or are you just listening to I've never worn vinyl. I would. If we had the budget to put that in post, we, wish, we would dress yeah. you in vinyl just in post right now. I would not accept that. Okay. So IHOP recently changed their name to IHOP for International House of Burgers. Have you thought of changing your show to Sports Center with uh, Jay and Burger, maybe? Not a bad idea. Would you, would you try it? Because we brought a burger and we just want to see that dynamic yeah. between you and a burger just doing highlights. Would you want to try that real quick? Okay, yeah. let's do it. So here we are, Sports Center with Jane Berger uh, in a toilet at the CTV building. I don't know about you, Berger, but I feel my career has gone down there. How about yourself? I'm about to be eaten, so it doesn't matter. Soon I'll be processed in your stomach and become waste, and then go into the Toronto sewer system where I will wither away and die. God, that's a terrible way to live out your existence. Uh, any last words? I hated you ever since I started working with you. You're pompous, arrogant, and you never give me the time at- Alright, that's enough. Cool. So Jay, as a sports anchor, you have to know the terms. You have to be in the know with all these different terms for all these different sports. Sure. So we're gonna list some terms. You gotta tell us which sport they belong I to. Love it. Watch that turkey bacon slide. Ah, so simple. Yeah. And I love this one. And I tell you, when I first started broadcasting, mm -hmm. uh, I was covering the Saskatoon Hilltops gotcha. of the Prairie Junior Football League. And uh, as you know, watch that turkey bacon slide is when a quarterback uh, slides to safety oh, without being yeah. hit, you know, risking those head injuries yeah, that so many football players suffer from problem. now. Yeah. Uh, so uh, they call the quarterback turkey bacon, mm -hmm. and, and so it's watch that turkey bacon slide. Show me the mustard. Uh, very, very yes. simple. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, you're playing tennis. Mm -hmm. uh, someone like Roger Federer, an amazing serve and volley type mm -hmm. guy, mm -hmm. right? Uh, approaches the net, little touch shot. Uh, other guy doesn't get to it. That means you showed him the mustard. mustard. Oh, oh my god. god. This one's a little newer. Um, it's Frankie Muniz on the ones and twos. Ah, so simple as yeah. well. So Frankie, of course, as we know, star of Malcolm in the Middle. Mm -hmm. uh, big LA Clippers fan. Of course. I don't know if you guys knew this. Yeah. He, back in the day, before the Clippers were cool, they're still not, but let's oh. pretend they aren't. It was Billy Crystal and Frankie Muniz. Those were the two celebrity uh, fans of the Clippers. Of course, mm -hmm. the Lakers had a ton of celeb fans. Yes. Uh, Clippers, hard, hardly any. Yeah. So Billy was the one. Frankie was the two, because obviously Billy Crystal, a bigger star. Oh, yeah. Frankie one. Muniz on the ones one, and two. twos. Though. So you guys are heavily sponsored on SportsCenter by Tim Hortons, and we wanted to get on that gravy train. So what we did was wrote a script, just a little ad to play. You know, having you in it could uh, could be a big influence for them. Hey, Adamo, what are you what are you slurping on? Oh, hi, Aaron. I'm slurping on a sweet old double double from Tim Hortons. Say hey, Jay. What are you slurping over there? Hi guys, I'm Jay Onright from TSN Sports Center with Jay and Dan, and I'm also slurping on a double double. What are you slurping on, Aaron? Well, I am slurping on one of their famous Angus steak fajitas. If you ask them nicely, they'll blend it for you so that you leave. Slurp on, pretty babies. Your fans love you for bringing your humor into the sports world. Mm -hmm. You're a funny, funny guy. So we thought we'd put you in a situation to see if you can funny your way out of it. So we call this segment Hostage Situation. I'm gonna hold Aaron hostage, okay. and you gotta just funny your way out of it, funny man. 
If you, I swear I'll kill him if you don't make me laugh, man. Uh, I'll do it. Hey, uh, I'm gonna do it. Uh, did you hear the one about uh, Donald Trump and Kim Jong Un? I don't think so. Yeah, they're both insane. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you can go. Oh, okay, okay well, I'm gonna take you. Right. I'm gonna take you. What? No, me? <laughs> thank you so much for being yeah, here. Thank you, Jay. Just for the kids at home, where can we watch you? Where can we yeah. listen to you? What's a podcast? Our demographics over 65, they don't even know what we're saying right now. I totally get that. Yeah. We're a big baby boomer thing, too. Mm -hmm. uh, for us, for the baby boomers, for the over 65ers, uh, we're on cable television, mm -hmm. uh, TSN, every midnight. Uh, Sunday through Thursday. Weird schedule, why? Yeah. So that we can loop in the morning, Monday to Friday. Right? I love when that kids movement, get you just did loop in the morning. Just like that, loop. Monday through Friday. We loop in the morning on TSN's four and five. And then the podcast comes out um, every Monday at midnight Eastern. Thanks, Jay. Thanks, Thanks Jay. It's really fun, guys. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Slurp on, pretty babies.